dress. I really think this dress, this just surprised me because I'm not much of a person who wears super oversized stuff. Um, and so wearing this dress right here and it being like oversized was kind of like, hmm, that's different for me, but I love the way it flowed and it honestly didn't even feel like it overpowered me in any way. Like I was able to wear the dress, style it to the way I wanted it. And it was, it was beautiful. Trust me. I went to the beach in this dress and let's see, what did I do? I went out to a restaurant. I had like a long day, but I want to say I wore this one to the restaurant and I paired it with some like square toed heels that were netted, like the popular ones. They're yellow and square toed and netted. I cannot remember like the name of them, but I wore that. I had a green purse, like the greens all in the dress. And we just had this kind of colorful artistic mosh posh going on. And you can even see the faces within the dress, which is really cool and interesting. Um, and that's another reason that made me want this dress. Now, Hutch does have a lot of dresses using this pattern. I want to say this is like their signature pattern. So I would definitely check out the other dresses they have in this print. And yeah, but all of the colors that's in this dress, you can definitely play with each and every one of them. Seeing that there's red, orange, peach, white, cream, green, lime green, dark green, there's burgundy. There's so many different colors in this that if you just find accessories like purses, earrings, jewelry, and anyway, shoes, you can definitely pull out the colors in this dress and create a nice, cohesive outfit. So this dress is one of my favorite colorful fashion pieces so far that I've done in my live stream show. The next one that honestly, again, surprised me because I was like, I don't usually like red, but when I saw this dress, I was like, I have to have it. So <laughs> this dress has these bellowy sleeves, which I love to like kind of roll up. So. I definitely like to roll up the sleeves like this. And it creates kind of like a cute, uh, I don't want to say Parisian. Let's see, what 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 time period is that? It's like, it, got, it gives you a little Regency vibe. I mean, it gives you like that time period, cottage core time period. Bam, that's what we're going for. It gives you cottage core type time period. I wore it with this like cream headband and it really felt like I was supposed to be with a picnic basket in my hands or a strawberry basket in my hand and just like walking through the garden. <laughs> so this dress is quite short, but it really flows and fits the body beautifully. And let me see if it's on here to present. I just knew I wanted to show you guys today. Yes, it's from the BOG Collective, the Marie Fuchsia baby doll dress. So it's a baby doll dress and baby doll dress 